walking to Athens. Yeah. And swimming. Yeah, we're not going to do that. Walking to Thessalonica, you know.
wow. Pretty amazing, uh, pretty amazing views. We've now come out from Petrostuga Refugio, and we're nearly up onto the huge plateau. And here we can see this adjacent set of mountains over the other side of this big valley. They look pretty barren, Mark, eh? Yeah. It's kind of lunar landscape like Mount Amara, isn't it? It's very similar, actually, isn't it? Yeah, very similar. Yeah. And don't fall off. So there it is. Scutter. views like that of Olympus in the plateau of the Refugio. So we're on the plateau and it's 20 past one. We've, we have been Exactly four hours. Much longer than you said, Jim. Indeed. I was thinking, yeah, two and a half hours, but... Rather optimistic in my... over-optimistic in my assessment. <sighs> Daisy. Daisy, what Jigs of houses, what happened? Did they just drop? Everything inflated and then dropped. What have you been called? Oh, oh dear. <laughs> That's the end of it. That on a film as well. Yeah, it's a career over. <laughs> so that'll be the truck to apostolitis.
lucky. 8,000 feet of catastrophe. You've got to post because you're going to be missing out on likes if you don't hurry up. stacks through there then over to the right up to Metakis summit and then essentially retracing and as you can see a guy way up there two people up there and these three guys here are completely shitting yeah. their pants better off over there they've completely lost the plot right over here these guys. Oh, there's some lads coming back. Why are they coming back that way? Well, look at how much we've come up. Yep. Are these the ones that set out with the guide? Yes. Who came in late last night? Two women. The bloke and the guide. Hey guys, how are you? Very well, thank you. Glad it's not raining anymore. Hi there. Turning out a pretty good day. Yeah, it's turning out a fantastic day. Yeah. Those well, dry is okay. Yeah. Would you go to the top? Yeah. Is it nice up there? Yes, very nice. Okay. That's fine. That price is the next mob.
top section. Here's where we've come up, sort of. All right, Roger. <laughs> it's a bit of an experience, eh? It is an experience. <laughs> it's a different type of activity. It's a full body type activity. It's not. It's not ping pong. It certainly isn't. Two eight, two eight. Two eight, two eight meters. <laughs> All right. So Jim's going first. He's um, launching himself off the side of.
Deixa eu ir. Bernardo. further to go, albeit slowly, we will get there. And then all we've got to do is get down. Go right round all that lot somewhere over the back. There you go. Take one. There you go. That's a mother of a climb. What was that like, Roger? It's quite hairy. Pretty crazy, wasn't it? But we're just <laughs> now focused on getting down. Yeah, it might be a bit fun with a problem in ten miles. We'll get over the other side. It might have a break, just have a water break and a bit of energy break. Yeah, oh yes, we know we break. It's, it's way past the lunch. Go now, we we kicked off.
You made it, baby! Look at Okay, well, we're uh, standing in the rain today. We're heading back down. This is Tuesday. We're heading back down to Prionia. We stopped the night in the refugio. Very smart move. Another nice night. And we're going down to get our vehicle to go to Athens. It's been raining real heavy. And we're just making our way down. It's been 900 meters from the refugio. So, what's the score, Mark? What do you think, baby? It's raining. It's going to be wet in the car. We're going to return a stinking wet car to Hertz, yeah. which is covered in dead with enormous hail. It wasn't my fault, <laughs> but they might not see it that way. Um, and uh, well, happy days, really. Yeah. Roger. We're all looking forward to shower. Roger. Yeah. Shit, shaving a shower. That's what we're all looking forward to. Oh, I'm not shaving. <laughs> I'm shaving. I'm going to get cleaned up. We ain't had a wash or a bath or a, a clean for three, four days, you know. So it's like total Che Guevara Chango style that we're going at the moment. The Airbnb guy always makes stubborn stuff. It takes me to say, well, if you want to live, I can do it for 38 euros. There's an interesting little fella that we've come across here. Yeah. actually pick him up and chuck him in the bush, haven't we? He's on his way, he's probably sinking up. He's going to get squished. He's going to get out of the way. It's a little salamander by the look. His bright orange might mean that if you touch him you get poisonous shit on you. Very true. Or he might be pretending he's poisonous when he isn't, but I'm not gonna i I'm not gonna find out. He's like that old man, isn't he? He's gonna get up there. Anyway, 